and welcome back to my channel if you're new here yeah, my name is Athena and um, yeah and this is my YouTube channel that I have uh, I have abandoned for like it must be since December or November something like that but yeah I'm here and um, yeah let's just have a chat I just feel like making this video just to have a chat just to update you on um, life on my life where well, I've been away for so long and um, yeah there's there is a lot of um, new things happening exciting things and um, yeah so um, yeah last time I've posted that was in maybe end of November or December something like that I keep posting like shorts you know like showing my you know um, sewing my headbands and stuff like that just you know for my for my small business but apart from that I haven't done anything substantial when it comes to my YouTube channel so yeah I've been away because I I'm going to be doing nursing hopefully so basically I'm gonna be doing nursing in September uh, which is mental health nursing it's two years um, yeah I was preparing for an interview in January so that's why you know I had to prepare and stuff like that and after I was accepted by the uni I was informed that they need my level to some English and maths so which is something I don't have I don't have GC on those things so this is something I've been doing so every week I'm doing online classes English and maths which is not easy when you're full-time mom working and all that but I made sure that you know that I'm free on those days and I do those online classes I've done my English exams which I passed and um, beginning of June I'm gonna do my maths exams and um, yeah I'm a bit worried about it that I won't pass because math is not my strong element but I just need to practice I've, that's what I've been doing I've been working doing my headphones you know um, I went away uh, to I went to Ghana that was back in end of November December then I went to Cyprus like a month or three weeks ago I came back so that was a month ago and um, yeah a lot of traveling and just spend time with my family and also I'm kind of pregnant as well so yeah we are pregnant yep we are 20 20 26 yeah I'm 26 weeks now so nearly on my third trimester yeah that's that you know like life so basically I would give I would be giving birth in August and starting school in September which yeah I know I know it's crazy and, and I know that um, I don't know if I can do it but I will try you know um, the good thing is I have got the place so if I need a break I can just postpone it I can even postpone it for January because I think they have um, admissions so it's it's September and January that you can start you know the course so we will see what can I say life has been just busy and crazy and my daughter now she's two two and a half years old and the more she's growing the more challenging she's becoming I thought you know every time you, you get into a new stage in your kids life like let's say in the newborn stage you think it's the worst oh my god and then they grow up a bit and they and they start walking and you think it's the worst and then they become toddlers 
and it's another it's another level of challenge and my daughter is becoming very naughty and challenging and i'm also pregnant so i can't i don't have the same patience i think i'm struggling with patience in general like i don't have patience you him is screaming and you know all day long but yeah that's 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 me and um yeah i don't have patience i could be more relaxed with her maybe but um i think when you are by yourself it just me and my husband my husband works most of the time then when i'm at home i'm the one who look after you know look after her there's no other siblings around there's no grandmas aunties around so it's everything is on you like you know you don't have anyone to release you just for a bit you know like um if you want to just do something for yourself there's no one to around to help you so that's that when you are a mom who lives abroad away from her you know um family away from her siblings that's what happens and i know a lot of moms can identify with me and i i empathize with you and i know i know how hard it, how hard it can be especially in this country in the uk i don't think they promote our families or they want you know, i mean they make it hard for people who are working to to have families because childcare is so expensive and if you don't have anyone to look after your kids while you're at work you're in deep you know like it's about 200 pounds a week i mean the minimum now i don't even know how much it is with the inflation prices and all that i don't know but it's ridiculous so you might as well just stay home and get benefits so is that what they want to to they want you to stay home and um i mean there's nothing wrong with a mom who wants to stay home if you can afford it if both parents need to work then what's gonna happen because life now is ridiculously ridiculously expensive like and if you don't work then what are you gonna do you can't stop yourself so i'm thankful that i have a good neighbor my other friend who look after her, look after her at times you know when we both need to work and um, i'm just so grateful for that otherwise i don't know what i would do i might as well just quit my job and that's it i just don't get why they and i'm not trying to you know bash anyone or to criticize or judge anyone but i don't understand why single moms if you if you stay home like stay home single moms basically they can have even the ones they're working yeah i think yeah so they get 15 hours free childcare when their kid is two years old so if you're at home i guess yeah it's fun you need that time for yourself as well so it's fine for your kid to go to nursery or whatever but if you that's just a luxury though like you know you have three hours just to stay at home and just relax but if you're a working person you really need childcare you really need this three hours but you don't get it because you're working and you're not entitled to it which is ridiculous I just find the system completely ridiculous but what can you do what can you do it could be worse so we just need to be thankful and um yeah just pray for more strength you know god give me more strength because it's just hard out here to be honest it's it's hard and um but it's fine as far as we're healthy and strong we can do it and that's the main thing i want to leave you with today because it's been a crazy year as you can see i'm pregnant um i'm doing these classes now i have only the maths 
and I'm trying to balance life, work, being a wife, being a, being a mom, um, you know, and all that. It's just not easy, but you just need to find the balance. And you can do everything with the right support. I've got a supportive husband, even though there have been issues. There are issues with marriages everywhere. Even though we are having issues and this and that, we are still here supporting each other and that's the main thing and um and having the right support is so important having support is very important because uh, now i'm able to go and and you know achieve what i want to become a, a nurse mental health nurse and i know my husband will be there to support me and i'm very grateful for that you need support in your life and um, you need the determination to go ahead and fulfill your dreams that because if you don't do anything about it it's just dreams so you need to go for it and um yeah i, I feel that i've been mumbling and ranting a lot um but yeah this is where this is where i've been and here i am i'm still here i'm alive okay i'm i'm here i'm alive so I don't think anyone is worried about that anyway but but yeah i'm just saying and soon i'm gonna be releasing my summer um collection i guess um headbands and scrunchies this is part of it it's this beautiful it's satin crepe so that's why it's it's and it's nice and thick it's um so from the website i get my fabrics they have some designers as well fabrics this is prada actually this is a prada fabric and i can't believe it like you know you can find stock you know fabrics from design and stuff like that which is quite cool so this is a prada let's say satin crepe headband super comfortable i don't really do satin headbands because they tend to slip and um, which is not really ideal but this is heavy a bit heavier and it's crepe as well so it kind of stays on the hair and um and yeah i have other headbands cotton headbands and also i'm gonna be releasing a night uh pampering kind of um routine set um so bas basically it's gonna be a set where you um it helps you you know it's like a headband that helps you to do your skincare then you have the scrunchy bracelets when you wash your face so it doesn't the water doesn't run everywhere I'm preparing a silk bonnet as well so when you sleep and three I think silk scrunchies um, you can do some heatless curls with scrunchies I'm gonna show you an editorial on that and and yeah and silk bonnet of course is um, they say it's, it's good sleep with a silk bonnet can help the hair not to freeze and to be become and to become very tangled because my hair gets so tangled my hair is so thin but anyway sidetracked already but yeah this is what i'm working on and i will be releasing it if i haven't already on my etsy shop i'm also planning to start a website sometime in july and I'm not going to be I'm not going to be going to work in July and also I won't need to I will finish with my maths so I'm gonna have some time to do my website because I think uh, if you have your worst if you have your website is more personalized like your items what you're selling is more is your shop Etsy is just a bunch of shops so it's like you go to the market and you see different different shops and sometimes you don't even know what to choose but if you have like a personalized website for you I think it, it can attract more people kind of I don't know maybe um, I think that's it for today my daughter is here of course I mean I'm like uh, where is she gonna come when when is she gonna come and she's here and she's here say hi 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 She's growing, isn't it? She's so pretty and beautiful. Yes. Yeah, for now. But she's no naughty. I do know that. Yeah. 
okay guys i would really appreciate if you subscribe to my channel if you like this video if you liked it and um and i'll see you in the next one bye, bye. Mm -hmm.